Now, I'm sorry. Yes, sir. No, go ahead. Uh, for the price match guarantee, does he have to be more trained certified? No. No. Um, and it's, it, no, it, it's, it's a good, it, you know, some of this morning said, well, that's not fair because I said, no, any dealership in Southern California can add a keep it new like program. Mm -hmm. Doesn't have to be ours. Any, any dealership can add a 675 named component warranty to their used cars. Mm -hmm. They just don't. They don't. Most dealerships are selling their cars as cheaply as they can and they're giving their customers as little value as they can because they're selling, selling them as cheaply as they can. The fact that your organization, as big and bad as you are, and there is no really other organization as big and bad as yours. I mean, number one Ford store, number two Honda store, number seven uh, VW, number one Mazda. I, I mean, look, I've worked with a thousand different stores. Never have I worked with an organization that's got the power that yours does. And your management team and your ownership has decided to give the customers more than anybody else does. It's a beautiful thing. If, uh, it, you know, I retired once and then I came back out to do this. I was going to do this one to two days a month. Friday will be my 73rd airplane flight of this year. Okay? I'm going to retire again in the not too distant future. And when I do, I'm going to, try, I'm going to find someone that's going to let me sell cars part time. But I'm not going to go to work for an organization that doesn't give me a good value proposition. Most stores' value propositions sound like this. We have a good selection. We take care of our customers like family, and our service department does a great job. Well, if everybody says that, it's not, it doesn't differentiate yourselves. You guys have got the best. But you have to know how to communicate it to the customer. Steve, I did have a question about yeah. the price match. Yes, sir. So um, say they find a vehicle at another dealership, mm -hmm. and not a new car dealer. It could be a used car lot, right? It sure. Could it could be Craigslist. It could be somebody's backyard. It could be a, so not a dealer, it could be like Anybody. a private party? Actually, and it lent some legitimacy to the program. Yeah. Yeah, but that's how that works. But again, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta communicate this powerfully. I'm gonna, we're gonna watch what I just did.